geology in a jiffy. What's in the bag? It's... Earthquakes. Earthquakes happen when large blocks of rocks in the Earth's crust suddenly move past each other. In our geology in a jiffy video about faults, we learnt that when one block of rock moves against another block of rock along the fault plane, the blocks can move up, down, back and forwards, or sideways. And when this happens, fast, an earthquake occurs. Take this land. If we study the rocks inside it, we see three layers of rock. If this block of rock is stretched, pulled apart sideways, eventually a weak spot will appear, from which shock waves are emitted. This weak spot resulting in movement along a fault plane, with this block moving downwards in relation to this block, causing an earthquake. That's amazing! The point underground where the movement occurred, here, is called the focus. The point on the surface that lies directly above the focus is called the epicentre and is where the shaking is strongest. Each year on Earth, more than a million earthquakes occur. Most of these are so small that people do not feel the shaking. Some are large enough that people do feel them, and a few are so large that they cause significant damage. An earthquake in New Zealand in 2016 damaged this road. We can clearly see the fault scarp, formed by the land this side, moving downwards, and this side, moving upwards. In this photo, we see a truck moving along a straight road, this parallel to a railway line. If we follow this length of road, we see the damage caused by an earthquake along a fault line. The land to the right, having moved downward, forming a steep scarp slope, and dropping the road downward, and leaving the railway line hanging in the air. Wow! Please do watch our Geology in a Jiffy video about the Richter scale. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye!